broadcast live. My money, Gams, my man. Yes, sir. Yeah. How are you, my dog? Doing amazing right now. How are you, bro? I'm good, my brother. I can't complain, my brother. And you just shot. I think we're at the second location for the Uvalo music shoot, bro. Mm. Tell me, bro, how are the fans? You know, didn't they want this immediately? Yeah, of course, bro. Like, they. It, yeah, because I saw with the, um, the videos that I've been uploading, dropping. They like, like on every comment section, it's like, we need Uvalo music video. So it's like, okay. But like, it's time I handle that. And I'm glad we're shooting today. Mm. And it was very crazy because, like, the call sheets were saying we're starting at like 4 30. Yeah. But we really missed that. We came at 5. Yeah. Yeah, but we're just going to finish it. I guess we're going to wake up tomorrow and start again, mm -hmm. trying to capture that, you know? Is it like a sunrise? I think so. I'm not. Sh I'm not too sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but like the director was like, "There's something that he was really trying to get, but we can't do it because we're late." Oh, okay. It was like five. So I, I think we're just gonna wake up tomorrow again, you know. Mm -hmm. But we at the second location. We just saw everything that we needed. I think we we off to the third one right now. Mm -hmm. yeah. And I think the third one is where Chava is gonna be there as well, man. Yeah, big homie. I think he pulling up. Mm -hmm. Definitely pulling up. We spoke about it. Supposed to pull up at 10. I don't know what happened. Mm. I think he got caught up here and there. But yeah, he definitely just takes the city coming through. Okay, okay. Shout out, my brother. And I know last week you dropped the deluxe. Got 20th, bro. Yeah, how has been the reception and the love for it, bro? I don't think I was actually looking for that. Honestly okay. speaking, bro, I think I, I didn't dip my, my job with like dropping. The, the actual album. Okay. With the Deluxe, it wasn't about like numbers or whatsoever. Even though I had the Ray Grass feature, mm. which was so crazy. I don't know, right? Um, it wasn't about that. It was like, since my album did well, did so well that we, we're sitting on a platinum right now mm. in less than like two months. I was like, you know what? As an appreciation to my supporters, let me just like drop my music, mm. you know, just like give it to them. You like know? what I was working on in Dubai. Ooh. Cause like with, with my project that I did last year, which was 19, I had a deluxe. Mm -hmm. So it was something like I wanted to do with, uh, with this one too, mm. you know? So I feel like the people are saying wrong timing, but like, I don't think it was wrong timing, you know? Mm -hmm. I wasn't trying to do like, Go number one, whatsoever. We did that, done that. It's okay. Mm. I feel like right now it was just like all about music and just like sharing a gift because I had um, Rick Ross, you know? Yeah. I want to talk about you having Rick Ross, you know? How did that feature come about? Because Ricky Rose is a big man. I saw that live that you were on too, you know? For so mm. I, I think uh, one of the brews on my team, uh, he's tapped in like that in America. And also, I think we're kind of signing the same thing, same team. So it's like when I was working on my album, I remember Sasigui, I think we were at Julie's or something. I was with Dus Java, and that time we were there to ask for Ives Lovalo. And then I got a text, um, AIT. I think AIT, yo, Rick Ross want, 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 want to jump on a song. And I was like, how? Oh. Huh? You know, and I sent it to my mother. I sent it to my bro. Mm -hmm. And then I was like, anyway, this is happening. We're here for Uvalo, but now we're just getting like a text that's, I mean, the, the big dog is trying to jump on um, What is this? Dangerous, right? Mm -hmm. So it was something like that, bro. It was so crazy. I never thought, I thought it was going to make it on time because if it made it on time, it was going to, it was going to be on my, on that, on the actual the album, album, you know? Okay. Yeah. So I feel like it took the longest time and it came right after I dropped. So mm -hmm. we was like, you know what? There's no way I'm just going to, I mean, chill and just like wait maybe next year. Because a lot of people are saying, yeah, you've done, your, mm -hmm. you've done, you've done enough. Mm -hmm. Let's wait for next year and go crazy again. I was like, you know what? This ain't about numbers, niggas, because I see that you're looking at it like Gamesho or business or something. Sure. You know, so I was like, you know what? Might as well just drop it, mm. you know, for the people so that they can what's going on. Because mm. I really love having my su my supporters, you know, knowing what's going on. My supporters tapped in like that, mm. you know. The so I feel like know. with the Rick Ross feature, he, he 
he listened to my shit and he wanted to own the song which oh, was so wow. crazy yeah yeah he didn't say i think a lot of people don't get this bro a lot of people think that we paid for that feature sure dog i don't think we do have that money to pay for that verse you he know? wanted it more yeah like mm. he wanted to have that song uh, uh for his album i think because okay. he's working on on his album but african artist you know he didn't want us he didn't say he wants the beats he said he wants the song mm. with my vocals on it mm. which was so crazy i didn't understand you know and i was so happy grateful that that actually happened you know a lot of people don't think a lot of people think that we paid but i i, I think it was talent bro yeah. fell in love with the music fell in love with the song decided to keep it and we told him that the original one is already out so we can't and he was like you know what it's cool mm. but you owe me a verse and i was like ain't no ain't no problem big dog we can do that so, that's big blessings bro that's so you're very much deserving of that bro because your motion has really been big this year brah and so i want to wrap it up my brother and just talk about like these songs i was listening to on your deluxe yes. it was heal and 2 p.m i don't know 2 p.m in dubai but it's written in a arabic way bro okay. There's a thing of you maybe being in a feud with A. Reese, bro. I don't know if that exists or it's just like potential rumors, but yeah. could you clear it up for us? Honestly speaking, bro, I am, I am a fan, but I just don't like how his supporters always come at me, you know? Mm, mm, mm. So it was just like, you know, cause like a lot of people and also him, I guess on Twitter, he took it there and just like, was on some, you know what? I'm putting it, I'm putting it on your face, mm -hmm. in your face, that you're know, number one and you independent, wada wada. And you know what? It was so crazy, but I don't think I'll ever diss him. I'm still a fan even now, even though they so, don't think I am a fan. Yeah. Still bump him. I couldn't even bump his album because like I dropped the same day, so mm. there was that feud, you know, everything going around. But I started listening to him like the day before yesterday, and I have to say, great project. And I'm not just saying this because you know. I am being genuine right now, yeah. but it's whatever. Mm. It's whatever with niggas, bro. Shut up, Like, bro, with bro. the supporters and stuff, I feel like Twitter and social media always be driving everything crazy, mm. you know? So, I don't know how he is going to take that, you know? But it's, it's whatever right now. It's real. Broadcast live.